In this video I will show you how to change master password on MT4, MT5 and MT4 Android version. I will also show you how to change investor password on MT4, MT5 and MT4 Android version. It is important to change the initial password for a protection or if you are changing the password every few months this will also help you how to change that. To change the password there are simple two ways and those two ways requests at least a two three seconds of your time and it is important to change your password once a while just for a protection if something happens with your account or someone steals your account logging details it is good to change them and have them stored somewhere on your PC or on your paper. If you change your password every few months, it is good. So if someone gets your account details, which were all the details, then he will not get the access to your account. So let's start. I will start first with MT4 trading platform. And here you can see that I have several accounts. Here I will change the password on this 11668487. This is the demo account on MetaQuotes broker server. So there are two ways. First way is a standard one where you click the tools menu, then options and the new window appears. In this new window you have several tabs and you need to position yourself to the server tab. In the server tab you can see here logging ID and here is the field where the password is entered. If you would like to change the password you need to click the button change. When you click the button change a new window appears where it says change password. Here are conditions that you need to follow to change the password. If you would like to change the password to a new one you need to have at least five symbols, you need to have a lowercase, uppercase and digit inside that password. So, first step is to put inside this field current password. To get the current password, you need to have it somewhere in your on your PC or on your email. Or if you are using a broker, then you have for sure at the admin area where you have also these details. In this case, I will click the cancel again, cancel and go to mailbox where I have received account details when I have registered this account. So here I here are my logging details. I will copy them. I will use notepad just as a help and I will put it here. A new password. I will put it like this. You can select which one do you want to use. I will put it like this today 123. It is a simple one. You can have it much more complex but for this video and this lesson I will put today 123 which is easy to remember. Okay now I can continue. I will close this mail. I will position myself to journal tab. This is just a good way to show you how the password will change and you will see here a message from MetaTrader 4 terminal, the password has been changed and is, and is everything okay or not? Okay, so the first way is go to the tools, options and server tab and change the password. Now you can see that the new window appears. I have the current password, this is the one and I have a new password which I have select, put it here. Before Moving forward, I need to show you a second way how you can change the password to get this window appeared. I will click cancel and again cancel. So the first way is go to the tools options. But the second way how you can do that is also go to the account here where the accounts are located. Click the right mouse button and then click change the password. You can see the same window appears here with all details like before. So I will continue with this one. I will put here current password. But have in mind if you have used notepad as I have like now, be aware that there is a space here. So I need to delete, to delete it because he will take the space and it will make a problem. He will not accept password change. So I will remove the space, copy it and put it here. 
I will select a new password, okay, put it here, put confirm it here and click OK. Before I click OK, just have in mind, in the journal tab, you can see it here, you will see how the terminal is changing these details. Click OK and you can see it here, master password change, terminal will be reconnected. Okay, in a few seconds, he has logged with a new password. This is the way how you can change your password on MT4 terminal. If, if you would like to return to the old password, you repeat the same process. Go to account, click right mouse button, or you can go to the tools, options, server tab and change. Now I will use the current password, which is today123. Okay, there is no space, so it's good. I will use the old password, put it here, confirm it, and look at here. Master password change, it will reconnect in a few seconds. I will close this one. Connect failed, invalid account. I will now connect with the old password, just a minute. Log into trade account. Now I need to enter the old one and click login. You can see it here. He has connected with the old password, so everything is good. I can use the old password I have received in the mailbox here, so everything is just fine. So these are two ways how you can change the MT4 password. You can use tools options and you can use right mouse button and change password. Now let's move to the MT5, how to change the master password. I will open the MT5 platform. I have here a one account and I will check in the new account registration mailbox which are my login details. I need them because I need to have the old password. Okay, put it here, MT5, okay, now let's move forward. In the, in the MT5, the steps are almost the same, you will see what is, dif what is different. First, you need to go to the tools, options, select the server tab, and then there is password and there is a button change. Select the change button and the new window appears. You can see there is also the same fields you need to enter. You need to enter the current password and the new password and confirm the new password. I will close this one and this one and show you how the second way works. It is almost the same. You click on the, this account, right mouse button, change password and here is the new window. What is different with the MT4 and MT5 is this one. You can see that there is here a condition that you need to fulfill and, in, and here are seven symbols that needs to be long and lowercase, uppercase and digit. Compared to the MT4 version there is at least five symbols necessary but here is seven symbols. So pay attention to this. The next step I will use my login details, also there is a space here, I will remove the space so I do not have the problems. I will copy this, the current password is this one and I will select the same new password. I have 2468, say 6, 6, 8, 8 characters long so this is fulfilled to this condition of the 7 symbols. So I will copy it, I will put new password here and confirm it. I will click OK. When I click OK, I will quickly open a journal tab so you can follow what happens. You can see that the message here is written, the change of master password is completed. So everything has been done just fine. Now I will change back to the old password, I will use right mouse button, change password, I will put here the current password which is today123 
and then I will return to the old one. The old one is this one. New password and confirm it. Then you will see it here, a message. 525, the change of mask password is completed. Everything has been done correctly. So this is the way how you can change the master password in MT5. Now I will show you how to change the master password in Android MT4 version. Okay, here it is. Here are my accounts. Now I will change the password on this account. This account is the same one as in MT4. I will show you this. Go back to the MT4. This is the account and currently I am logged in here. I will put a journal tab here so you can watch what happens when I change the master password on Android version on the same account at the same time. I will move this one here so it is easier to follow. Now see, see this. You need to click here on the three dots change password and then here you have two options so you can change the master password or change investor password in this case i will change master password so i will put here what is the current password i will open notepad as a help to see it which is the current master password this is the one i'll put it here Okay, and I will put here a new one, which is today. One, two, three. I will confirm this one here. Today, one, two, three. And you can see here it says the same message. The condition is five symbols. I have put eight symbols, so this is not a problem. Click next. And the password has been changed. You can see here in the general tab the connection failed because look at here the connection failed because it has invalid account so this metatrader 4 currently cannot connect to the broker server because it has a wrong password let's return back here so if you want to change again you repeat the same process the current password is Today, one, two, three, the new master password is the old one, which is RVG1QHO. Let's repeat again. Click next, and the password has been changed. This is good. Okay, now I can use the old password to connect to the old, to the uh, connect to this account. Okay, log in. Here it is. Everything has gone through just fine. So this is way how you can change the master password on MT4, MT5, and also MT4 Android version. Now. I will show you how to change investor password, which is the same process as master password. So I will show you only on MT4 and MT5, so you can see how to do that. Okay, now I'm on MT4 version, I will click Tools, Options, Server tab is open, button Change, and change here to the investor password. So I want to change this one, investor read only password. Now I will use investor password, remove the space here, so you, do, you have no problems. Copy it, current password is here, and the new one will be today. Confirm it, click OK. Now you can see that there is a problem. I have received a message. I cannot change the password, not enough rights. What I have done wrong is this. 
when I have tried to change the password, I have put here selection to the change investor password. And here I have put current investor password. But this is the problem. I should not use investor password here because it says must be the master password. So I need to use the master password here and then select a new one for the investor password. Look, then click OK. And you can see here, investor password has been changed. So this is the way how you can change the investor password. Now let's see, let's see how this works on MT5. I will click the right mouse button, select change password, and then here select change investor password. And here in the empty field, I will enter master password. So pay attention to this. Okay, I will remove the space, copy it. Oh, sorry, I made a mistake, sorry. Uh, master password must be here. Click on it. Now I will put a new password which will be today123 and click OK. And you can see here there is a message change of investor password has been completed. So this is the way how you can change investor password on MT5. Now let's see how to change investor password on MT4 Android version. It is the same process as before on master password. Ok, now the process is the same like changing the master password. Click three dots in the upper right corner, click change the password and here select change investor password. The current master password for this account is this one. I'll put it here. R V G one Q H O. New investor password will be today. One two three. Confirm it. Today. One two three. Click next. Password for this account has been changed, and this is the process how to do this. So you can see. It's pretty easy to change the password, master password also and investor password. It takes only a few seconds to make that, to make that change. If you change your password here in the MT4 or MT5, position yourself in the journal tab so you can follow what happens here. Pay attention to the message you receive here sometimes. There will be a problems, but here the message can help you solve that problems because some of the message clearly explains what is the problem. So you will be able to, to find the cause and solve that problem easily. I hope this lesson has been helpful. If you like this video, click the like button and subscribe. And see you next time and happy trading.